you very much for coming. Yeah, thank you. Uh, now, Navid, you uh, came to us a few weeks ago, uh, a few months ago now, actually, with double vision. But can you tell us, how old are you first? 32 years. 32. And are you right or left-handed? Uh, right. Right-handed. And what was the first time you noticed a problem was wrong? Uh, it the was the um, beginning of uh, September uh, this year that I was doing a grocery and I noticed that I'm uh, going through the shelves and I'm missing uh, kind of frames. From on, on my right side. Were you seeing one or two of the objects, or what was this? Uh, I didn't notice that much, you know. I, I just uh, uh, noticed that there is something wrong with my uh, sight that I'm not able to see or uh, uh, concentrate, see clearly the objects what I'm looking for. Okay. And I spend like uh, a much longer time doing a grocery that day. Uh, but, uh, but the next day I was supposed to go on a trip to Sweden. So. You know, it was uh, before that. Uh, then I went for my eyesight checkup, and uh, I find out my eyesight uh, are weak for the first time after years old. But what were you experiencing? So it was blurred vision all the time, or was it double vision, or was it loss of vision? So how would you? I mean, were you seeing two of things or silhouettes of things? Can you distinguish between those? Uh, I think it was uh, blur plus. Uh, uh, I think uh, double. And did you have any pain with this? Uh, the, yes, there was a very slight pain, and I, w I started taking. Uh, uh, I had, I used to have the high cholesterol uh, uh, once, uh, so I thought it might be the cholesterol. Right. Uh, I'm having uh, high cholesterol, so I, I started taking uh, half aspirin in the morning. Oh yes, I remember that. Health medication. Sorry. No, no. Well, <laughs> well, welcome to the real world. Uh, so you were taking aspirin, um, but you had pain where? Uh, on my right side. And can you draw out for us where the pain was? Was it uh, quite specific or was it vague? Uh, now I know it was here, yeah. but <laughs> at that time I didn't notice. I didn't. Uh, was it pain to move the eye, or was the head pain separate to the blurred vision? If uh, you understand, it, it was there. So there was pain all the time. Yeah. Not pain moving the eye as no, such. No. And uh, the double or blurred vision was it worse in one direction, like up, down, left, right? Um, I, I I don't uh, I cannot say now. I mean. Fine. At that time, I didn't uh, notice and that much. No, sure. I mean, you'll become an expert at this <laughs> stage. But uh, um, did you have any problems anywhere else affecting your vision, your speech, your swallow, your arms, or your legs? No, no. Okay. Uh, and s over time, after much scanning, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, uh, things improved initially. The pain went away fairly quickly after we treated you with some steroids. Yeah. But then, as we brought the dose down, yeah. the pain quickly came back, and the double vision came back. And so you've been kind of going up and down ever since. Uh, Double vision remained there. All the time? All the time. Uh, and it improved a fraction, or am I just making that up? Uh, no. It did didn't uh, improve? No. Okay. Until, until I mean, uh, in the last few weeks, uh, when I started taking the uh, uh, agent, uh, Imuran. Imuran. So yeah. you switch from steroids to a steroids sparing, sparing agent called Imuran or azathioprine. Okay. Well, do you mind if I then just sh uh, demonstrate the eye movements at this stage? So if you can just put your glasses down to one side, if you don't mind, and if you keep your head still, I want you to look straight at my finger here, and in the primary position, uh, it actually looks okay. I can't see clear ptosis. You'd be suspicious on the left, but not really. No clear ptosis. The pupils are equal. The eyes are symmetrical, and there's no nystagmus at rest. So I'd ask you, if you don't mind, uh, Nabi, to keep your head still and look to your left, and up a fraction. There we are. And then look to your right, and to your left. Right, left, right. I look at my finger here. Left, right. And the moment you see two, let me know. Yes. Now? Yes. Are they getting further apart? Yes. And are they beside each other or on top of each other? Uh, uh, beside each other. So one is far away from you and one is near. OK, one outside. Can you point them two out to me? Point them out. One outside, yep, and one inside. One, two. Okay. One is clearer, but definitely two. Okay. If you could gently cover your right eye, which one goes away? The one far away or the one near? Far away. That's fine. And let your hand down again and back into the middle. So I'll do that one more time. You just see one there? Yes. And out. And the minute you see two, let me know. Uh, and they're separating further and further, yes. and they're in parallel. Yes. Okay, so if you cover your right eye, 
the outside image disappears when he covers his right eye. So this implies, as we can see, he's got a right lateral rectus weakness. He gets double vision in the direction of gaze. It separates the further he looks in that direction, and the outside dim, uh, image disappears when he covers the weak eye. So classic right lateral rectus palsy. Uh, it's a sixth nerve palsy in this situation, and uh, we now know that uh, he has an isolated um, strange, unusual syndrome called Tolosa, T-O-L-O-S-A, Hunt syndrome.